I grew up in San Salvador, El Salvador, and I always knew I wanted to pursue dance. I asked for dance classes when I was about three, and I never looked back. I was born in Russia, and when I was five, we moved back to Bulgaria, where my parents were originally from. It was 12th grade, and I was deciding, do I want to go to school in Western Europe or US? Delphi really made a lot of sense because of the proximity being close to Manhattan, a good business school. So what I ended up actually doing is a five-year program where I graduated with a finance as well as an accounting degree. Right after graduation, I had secured an internship. After two months working with them, they decided to offer me a full-time position. I specialized in the audits of private equity and hedge fund clients, as well as uh, tech startups. After three years, I decided to uh, change a little bit of careers and started interviewing and decided to start working in Goldman Sachs. I'm researching different universities in New York, I came across Adelphi. It turned out it was one of the oldest dance programs in the nation. And with Frank Augustine leading it, he's incredible. It was just the perfect place to be. I got an internship at Ballet Hispanico and I started actually teaching there. So I was dancing not only from Monday through Friday, but on the weekends too, I was in the city. And that would not have been possible without Adelphi being so close to the city and without the teachers. My first job in Adelphi was working in the cafeteria. So I was working in the register and this pretty girl came across the hall and actually came and ordered fries. I was snacking a lot on purpose <laughs> after we met. I was spending a lot of time at post. And then one time he goes, you know, you're a dancer so maybe we should go check out a, a dance show. And I thought it was one of those things that maybe you say but never happen. But two days later, we were at the Joyce Theater watching the Limon Dance Company. I was like, oh, this is it. <laughs> I started working initially in the cafeteria, then I started working in the career center, then I worked for the controller's office, then I started working for one of the deans, like being her assistant, working with different managers, different work styles, also that helped me leverage that once I went to corporate America and uh, be adaptive to the situation. Adobe has a faculty that works in the field. They're not just went to get a degree, graduated and went into teaching. They have been in the field, they know how it works, they have experience. And that is very valuable because it means they have a network in the arts, that's everything. Mm -hmm.